The U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs reports that there are more than 100,000 Vietnam veterans in Massachusetts. Jonathan Bibbin, a Vietnam veteran, says the war was brutal and led to many health issues, but also created camaraderie. One of our main mantras in Vietnam, never leave any man behind. Boston has services for low-income veterans through Massachusetts General Law Chapter 115 that gives them access to medical care, food, clothes, and housing. Robert Santiago, commissioner at the Mayor's Office of Veteran Services, says that's not all. The city also has a relief fund for those who don't qualify for Chapter 115, which is unique to Boston. All they have to do is come with us with some sort of documentation that they need you know, uh, you know, assistance from us, and then we'll go ahead and from that point with that documentation uh, be able to, uh, to assist them. Santiago says the Veteran Services Office also works closely with more than 200 veterans nonprofits in the area and they have a great partnership with the Veterans Affair Boston Healthcare System. Bibbin says he gets help from the Jamaica Plains VA Medical Center. Fortunately, we have a government that is willing to take care of those medical needs. The Mayor's Office of Veteran Services is creating a new transition and integration advocate position to help veterans adjust back to their lives. This position is new to Boston and will begin in December. Reporting for BUTV 10, from Boston, I am Aisha Kulibali.